Well, hi guys. So this morning we are off to hospital. Yeah. We are. Kira has a hospital appointment for her eyes. Um, she gets cysts on her eyes and her eyes become very, very sore. And lately the school have said that the thing she might be struggling with her eyesight. Um, so we took her to see a normal optician and Kira can't cope with that and they can't cope with Kira. So we've been referred back to hospital to get the specialists to look at us. So today we're going back to hopefully uh, see if they can help get Kira's eyes a little bit better and do an eye test. Yeah. But as it's out of Kira's routine, <clears throat> Normally, obviously, she gets up, has her breakfast, gets sorted, and goes to school on the bus. This is out of her routine, so she's got a little bit upset, and I've had to climb into the back with her. Um, and she's calm now that I'm in the back with her. She kept climbing out of the car seat and undoing her belt, which isn't safe. So the safest option is for me to sit in the back with her. <laughs> so she's happy now, aren't you? Yeah, we're gonna go do a light test. Okay. What we're gonna do? We're gonna try some glasses on, do you think? Yeah. So yeah, I just thought I'd do a little uh, video to tell you what we're up to today. Daddy's driving, as always. Aaron's in the front. Shout, hello guys. Aaron. Hello. Aaron. Hello. Uh, Is it a, you're not in a good mood, are you? No. Why? Because I don't want to go to the hospital. Sometimes you have to. Because it's like we'll live there. I know, because it's lit there, we'll go. We've got it from here. Because it's like we'll live there. He's going to come in and and you know this isn't even the last appointment of the week either it's been an absolutely hectic this week hasn't it um so we're at the children's hospital in sheffield today and then tomorrow morning we're back for aaron to go and have an uh, a hearing test and he had a scan on his brain not like on his it was on his brain but on his ears if you get us to, because he's good yeah does it work properly they need to know what's causing it and whether he needs to have another bar half fitted so they had to do a specialist hearing test um and we're gonna go tomorrow and get the results of that and find out whether he needs another operation which aaron won't be happy about because he doesn't want another operation which I don't blame him, nobody would, but when you've had over a hundred oh operations, it starts to wear a little bit thin. Um, but we know, yeah, we know that having the bar heart that he's got now made such a massive difference to his life. Yes, um, it made such a massive difference to his life that if they say he needs another one, it's a no-brainer. Because we know that having the other one would, it would improve him 100%, wouldn't it? It would give him pretty much full hearing. Um, so we know that even though he doesn't want another operation, um, it's not life, it's not like a life-threatening operation, but it, it will be life-changing for Aaron having full hearing. Um, so if he does have to have it, he won't be happy, but we, the choice will be, be made tomorrow anyway, whether he likes it or not. Um, so we will keep you guys posted and we'll let you know how Kira gets on today at hospital. Fingers crossed. Kira, are you going to say bye-bye? Bye. 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 Ah. So we have been to see the optician. To do a little eye test on Kira. Um, it didn't go down too well. She's in meltdown mode. She's climbed under the table and started hitting the table and kicking off, so they couldn't do the full test today. So they put away in a little quiet room while we wait for the ophthalmologist to have a look and see what we can do about Kira's eye. 
just in this quiet room yeah. now waiting. Yeah. And Kira's still in crisis mode. Yeah. Meltdown mode. Yeah. No. The test. Yeah. No. She did all right considering the mood people. that she was in. Yeah, Considering the mood she was in, she'd done all right, but they couldn't finish it at all. They couldn't eat, they couldn't get near her. The lady was brilliant with her though. The lady got on the floor. She sat under the table with her. And it worked for a little while and then she stopped Stop hitting the table again and just being being crisis, in crisis mode. Um she's throwing it down there, I think. So now it's just wait to see the ophthalmologist and hope that she can get close enough to have a look how to see how so Kira's eye and how swollen her eyelid is. And hopefully they can do something to help her. It's not nice being oh having so itchy eyes all the time. I won't take! Give me it now! Aaron's not doing anything. He's just spinning something on a no. little garage. I'm and Kira okay. has decided that oh, Aaron's not allowed to do anything. He says Aaron's not allowed to do anything. Yeah. He was. No, you don't, Aaron. I do. This is why I didn't want to go. You really, really, while she's like this in crisis mode and meltdown mode, you have to help as much as possible. No. And if that means giving in and giving her a toy, that's what we've got to do to keep her no. calm. We we'll have to. I know. Because we can't stop. When this is not as bad as it can get, we don't want Kira to start hitting us while we're out because yeah. it makes pe it, people stay and we don't need that. Plus, we don't want them to be hit. So keeping that calm is the best thing to do. Because we don't want her to stop. A lot of people watching, watching this video might think that's bad. To be fair, this is quite wild compared to when it comes Yeah, that, yeah. This yeah, yeah. is, this is totally calm compared to how bad it can really get. No! Okay. I don't want it. You. Nobody wants it. I'll put it in, okay? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it can get a whole lot worse, can't it? I want my toy now. She, she could have, she could be beating one and hitting one. She did start biting herself and trying to undo her shoes. But luckily she didn't pee in protest. No, I'm the that, pee. That's not no let's that's not do that. that. I'm the pee. Oh, let's go to the toilet then. No, don't want to. Kira, do you think there's some gloves in there? Have a little look. Oh, Is it gloves? There we go. One thing that gets her through hospital appointments <laughs> is doctor's gloves. She absolutely loves them. Don't you? Show us. Yeah. How do you do it? You show us. Are you going to be the doctor? No. I'm going to be the doctor, isn't it? No. I'm going to be the assistant. <laughs> I'm going to do my chair. Mm hmm. Do you need help getting that on your hand? So, Kira's the doctor, and Evan's the assistant. I'm going to be the child, and I'm going to kick off to see how they like it. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, she didn't like that, Dad. She didn't like that. Okay. Here, do you want me to put the glove on you? No. No, okay. I don't want you to wear the glove. Well, you're going to have to deal with it. I think it. some of it, I Thomas, off. I think she's a bit no. tired because she's been yeah, yawning. I, deal with I it. think she's a bit tired. Yeah. It's completely out of her routine, isn't it? I'm going it. Mainly because she's, she has had a decent night's sleep. I'm going to throw it. It's the routine, yeah. isn't it? I'm going to She's out of her routine, Sorry. even though we were prepared, I we told her that she was going no. in. This is what's no. going to be happening. No. We've got her prepared, no. but she's still no. it's out of the routine. No. Just leave it. No. Just leave it. No. Just leave it. No. Just leave it. No. Just 
she's just having a tough day. Well, That's all. It's, it, this is our hey, Akira's man, routine man, and she does it go. when our routine is changed. Normally she's at school. Well, she doesn't cope when her routine, routine is changed. Well. I'm not ah! You don't have autism. The change to your routine is nothing compared to Kira's. Kira. To Kira, Kira right no. now, it's no. the end of the world for her. Me. It's major. No. She's not no. at school Come. with her friends doing stuff. And this is completely out of the ordinary and she doesn't like it. I well, hate you, I'm not because... You don't I have a routine. Talking. What? You don't what? have a routine. I do. No, you don't. I do. No, you Stupid don't. Because when the kids are at when they're at school and you're being homeschooled, every day I'm is different. Pay. We've got appointments. We've got this. We've got that. We there's never a routine. I don't want to go to school. Okay then. I'm staying here. What do you think they'd be I'm doing at school? No What do you think no. they'd be doing now at school? Everyone! If you were in school, do you think you'd be baking? Honestly, sometimes it comes down. I'm taking my room. Yes, but it does. Stop! Stop. That's a way! Kira, do you think they'd be baking at school today? It works! Not today. Do you think you'd be swimming? No! Do you think you'd be pushing Bradley? No! If you want to have the mood, it could be. Copy and it'll take her out. Mate, I'm saying it's not working. Right Stop now. it! Yes, but I'm trying. It looks like it doesn't work, then it works afterwards. I'm trying. Honestly, just try it and it'll work. No, it didn't work. I'm trying it. I appreciate your help and all that. I got my hair checked. Oh. Stop! Stop! Stop, Aaron, now. No, you just ignore it. You ignore it. She doesn't mean it. Just ignore her. Yes, do. You're just being grumpy. Yeah, because I don't want to be grumpy. Oh. Thomas, come a day in the mouth. life of us. Yeah. Absolutely and they mental. Get at yeah, absolute chaos. Yes. Yo, Don't have it any other way. Strangely, no. Mm. Strangely, no. Sometimes. <laughs> no way! Sometimes. No way! I know! <laughs> oh, look at that face. I don't even know what to say. Yeah. I get it down there! Every time we're talking, we go. And you can't <laughs> get it out! I wouldn't have it any other way. I'd have. I wish they didn't suffer. Hello. I'm here because you stole the heart of the city. Well, we are back in the car now. Um, we saw the ophthalmologist who couldn't get near her again. Um, she's Kira won't let the doctor have a look at her eye. So she says, from what you can see, Kira has blepharitis. Um, it's not as bad as it can be. It does get worse than what it is today. So she's giving us some special antibiotic drops and a special steroid cream to put on the lid. Um, so we're gonna try that and hopefully that'll work. We have to come back next month. We have some drops to put in her eyes the day of the appointment to let them work. And hopefully she's in a better mood that day and the drops will make it so that they can actually see if she needs glasses or not so fingers crossed the next appointment goes well today kira has just the meltdown was unreal she was underneath the table kicking and hitting the table and the, then the doctor first the optician woman was brilliant with that and got on the floor under the table and was i can't stress how nice it is when doctors have patients like that because some doctors don't have patience with her. Um, but this, this lady had loads of patience with her and I can't thank her enough. Because, um, you know, it, it is tough when she's like that. And she's, she's, just, she's just in crisis mode. And she just point blank refused to do anything. But the, the doctor, she with her patience and she just waited. And she, she was lovely with her. So thank you very much. For that 
it makes our day go a little bit smoother when we have people who are nice. Um, and then they put her in a quiet room, which you've seen. And we've been, and she's happy now because she's out of hospital. She's gonna get back to her routine now and hopefully the rest of the day will go smoothly. Um, so yeah, hopefully the, fingers crossed this uh, medication works for her. Now we're gonna go and get her back to school. Yeah. I don't want to go to Oh yes, it's nearly dream time, we're going. I want to get to um, toys. So we'll catch you guys later. Thank you for watching. <laughs> If you want to see more from our crazy chaotic family then hit subscribe and give her a little like and then uh, yeah thanks for your support there will be more videos like this where you get an insight into what it is like with living with autism epilepsy and hypermobility uh, global developmental delay Aaron's deafness my deafness we give you guys an insight and try to raise, raise awareness of the conditions that we live with day in and day out. So yeah, please do hit subscribe, hit the notification bell, and then you won't miss any more videos like this. Um, some of them will be funny, some of them will be sad, but that's life in it really. Our life is chaos. Oh look, she's going again. Where are we going? Okay, you don't have to go to school. Okay, there you go. Okay. Things you've got to say to calm her down, honestly. Erin, just be quiet. Uh, things you've got to say to keep her calm. There we go. Yeah. Um, yeah. Thanks. Bye.